Well, we're learning more about the upcoming arrival of the coronavirus vaccine in Yuma County. By months and many frontline workers could be vaccinated as the FDA is on the verge of its final decision. 13 on your side's Cody Lee brings us the latest on those vaccine plans. Christian, good evening to you. The state of Arizona will receive over 350,000 vaccines for the first initial phase of distribution. Now, Yuma County says it'll likely only see about 2% of that. With less than 5,000 vaccines, you're probably wondering who will receive the vaccine first. It will be prioritized with healthcare workers up first, then essential workers and those with underlying medical conditions, as well as the elderly. Both the Pfizer and Moderna vaccine requires two doses per person, meaning whatever amount the county gets will have to be split in half. Yuma Regional Medical Center confirming for us tonight that it will receive the Moderna vaccine in a matter of weeks. Uh, we were just notified that we are getting the Moderna. We are not getting the Pfizer. With Moderna is, uh, is very beneficial to us. Uh, it does not need that ultra low temperature. Moderna is distributed through McKesson. We directly have relationship with McKesson, so it will be still you know, technically routed through the county, but we, it is, uh, you know, we'll receive the shipments directly from the distributor. Meanwhile, the FDA is one step closer to approving Pfizer's emergency use authorization application. After an approval from the FDA, it's the CDC's turn. A committee there must also give the vaccine a green light. And Christian YRMC hopes to vaccinate its clinical staff first, who are in direct contact with patients on a day-to-day -day basis. And they tell me that the first shipment come as soon as December 21st. Reporting in Yuma, Cody Lee, 13 on your side.